Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm sharing a DIY as well as a little bit of Christmas decor. I'm using these picture frames that I got from the Dollar Tree. So this project really only cost $2. Everything else is items that I already had. So I'm just taking these frames apart. And along with those, I printed out the words Merry and Bright. I'll just be cutting those out. I'm not using any of the inside of the frame. All I need is the glass. So once I remove that, I'm just gonna take out these little tabs and then I'm gonna spray paint these gold. One is already gold, but um, the other is silver. I'm just gonna spray paint that one to match. And this is the letters once they're cut out. So I'm just cleaning off the glass because I'm gonna attach that and I'm gonna use this very clear tape. This would work best with packaging tape because then you would only need one strip, but I ended up having to use a few rows of this, but in the end, you really can't tell. So I'm just laying this down across the word and it is upside down so that it reflects the other way on the other side of the glass. So this video is in participation with the DIY Mommy's DIY and Decor Challenge for Christmas. And um, a link to the playlist is in the description box. So please feel free to check that out. And here with that one strip laid down, I'm just taking this other piece to cover over the Y where it hangs. So I'm just cutting off that extra little piece here and I'm left with this on the other side. And then I'm just gonna cut off the tape that's hanging off on the edges. And I'll do the same thing to the other frame but the other one is an 8x10 so I'm just putting that to the side while I start on the one that's going to be the word bright so the B for bright is un is not connected so I had to add that in so I'm doing pretty much the same steps here I'm just adding that extra piece of tape for the G that hangs down cutting the excess off and then adding another row to the top so it, that the word is completely covered by the tape and now that the frames are dry, I did add an extra coat of the gold paint to the gold frame anyway, just so it's the same tone. And I'm just gonna use my hot glue gun to place some lines of glue on the inside of the frame all the way around. And then I'll insert the piece of glass so that the word is facing out. And I actually forgot to add the dot for the eyes, so I'm just adding that in now. And then I did the same gluing process for the other frame that holds the word Mary. And this is how they looked when that was all done. So for just $2, was just an easy DIY and some very nice decor. So I'm taking apart my fall mantle. This is what I did for fall. And I'm gonna be placing, putting everything together, the frames as well as some pieces that I already had. And this is neutral decor that I'm gonna be going with for Christmas and it's very minimal as well. So I'm just wiping that down to add the pieces. And I'm starting out with this string of lights. These were outside on our porch but um, they're indoor outdoor lights so I'm just using those here this is my Scandinavian style and that emphasizes lights so I am definitely going with these clear um, bulbs here and then I'm using this garland that I put together out of a um, stem that I purchased from Michaels and that's in a previous video of where I show the haul of all the items that I got and I made this garland at that time. And then I'm using these reindeer that I made last year in a Dollar Tree DIY. So these were made with all Dollar Tree products as part of a look for less challenge. And if you're interested in seeing how I did that, I will link the video in the cards above as well as in the description box. So you'll see the full tutorial about how I put these together. And these are candle holders. So I have these candles here. I'm not gonna light them, but I am gonna put these in. And 
And then I'm just adding the frames to the other side. This is a quick close up of how they look and I'm just putting those there. So with this being a minimal um, decor style, this is all I'm gonna do. So this is how everything looks from farther away and then a little bit of a close up here so we can see how everything is laid out. And then on the side wall, I have this DIY advent calendar that I put together in a previous video, which will be linked in the cards above and in the description box. So I had used the same um, stems for that garland as I did for the one that goes across the mantle here. So it is coordinating and it's also greenery and gold. So I thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.